The IRS will start processing returns on January 27th, and with the start of tax season right around the corner, we've got a few tips to get you on your yes. way. And joining us to help you out here, we've got CPA Kimberly Washington to share some of these helpful tips. Yes. As always, busy time of year for yes, you. So it is. Thank you so much for coming in for a little bit. We appreciate it. So let's start things off. What's new, Kim, this tax season? So what's new this year? One of the biggest changes is the no individual mandate. So this was a mandate that was imposed in the previous years. If you didn't have health care insurance, you had to pay an additional fee. But when you file your tax returns this tax season, you will not be responsible to pay that fee. So that may be welcome news for many. But that's one of the major differences. And of course, the second difference are itemized deductions and standard deductions. The amount of standard deductions have increased a great deal. So many people, of course, may not need to itemize this year. Kim, what would you say are some other moves that taxpayers should consider here? I would say as far as deductions are concerned, there are many different type of deductions that's often overlooked. One in particular is called a non-business bad debt. This is a case of individuals loans you loans money rather to an individual and that person does not pay you back you may be able to take it as a deduction on your tax return so that may be one that's often overlooked and so you want to kind of look and see if you qualify for this deduction what would you say are some other overlooked deductions for individuals I would say as far as mileage is concerned many people think about business mm -hmm. mileage but they don't think about medical mileage and also charitable mileage too as well so if you're traveling a lot going back and forth to the doctor maybe volunteering too as well you may want to keep a Law can keep track of that because you may be able to take it as a deduction. All right, Kim, and finally, give us those Kim cents. Yeah, so as you prepare for this year, I have a great tool on my website. It's a tax organizer with overlooked deductions, things that you can look at, and it's on my business website at washcpallc.com. But it's a great tax organizer to get prepared for this tax season. And as you're seeing right there on your screen, yes. if you have any questions about what is deductible, you want to get organized this tax yes. season, Kim's got a great tax checklist on the website. It's listed right there. You can also follow her on social media to get those questions answered. Yes. As always, thank you thank so you much. So I know much. time to yes, get rolling, it right? It's definitely time to get rolling. Yes, thank you. All right, thank you, Charles.